sweet friends welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new my name is Ashley and today I have some laundry motivation for you I am starting out with what I consider an easy load and the reason why I consider the towels an easy load is because I do not mind folding them and putting them away it's just very easy to fold them and just put them away I'm not hanging up anything so I consider this load a very easy load to do so I'm going to go ahead and throw the dirty towels in the washer to get them all washed and clean. I'm using my Downty Light scented beads and the Ocean Mist scent. I'm also using some laundry sanitizer as well as my favorite laundry detergent, which is the Method brand in the Ginger Mango scent. So now that the towels are done washing, I'm going to go ahead and transfer them into the dryer and get them all dried. And while they are drying, I'm going to go ahead and throw in my next easy load that I consider very easy, which is Madison's clothes, because all I have to do is wash and dry her clothes. I do hang up a few of her pieces to like hang dry and I don't throw them in the dryer. But other than that, she folds everything and puts everything away for me. So that load is super easy as well. Is there a load of laundry that you consider easy that you don't mind folding and putting away? If there is, let me know down below in the comments what load that is for you. Like I said, that's towels for me and then Madison's clothes just because I don't have to fold and put away any of her clothes. So it's just quick and easy for me. Um, and it's not that I don't mind like doing the washing and the drying part and I really don't mind folding and putting away clothes. It's just there are certain loads that are just so time consuming when it comes to folding and putting away. So it just takes more time to get those loads knocked out and if I just sit down and do it then I can get it done and over with quickly but sometimes I just put it off and I'm trying to get better at that but um, also I would love to know how many days it takes you to complete your weekly laundry so in this video it's going to take me three days to do five loads of laundry and that sounds crazy when I say it but it's just sometimes we're super busy so it's hard to get around to getting all the laundry knocked out I would like to like typically here lately I've been trying to get it all knocked out in two days but sometimes that doesn't happen sometimes it's three sometimes it's four and there's been times where it's been five days for me to get all the laundry done and um, I just work at my own pace but I would love to know down below in the comments how long it takes you to complete like your weekly laundry and how many people are in your family so for our household there's six people it's me my husband and our four kids our oldest is Madison and then we have Jacob Jeremiah and Ryder which is the one helping me right now put all of Madison's clothes in the dryer and with that I always have at least five loads of laundry per week so I have the load of towels I have Madison's clothes I always wash Jacob and Jeremiah's clothes together sometimes there's so many that I have to divide it up into two loads and then Ryder has his own load and mine and Nick we wash our clothes together so that right there is five loads sometimes six depending on how many clothes me or Nick have or um, Jacob and Jeremiah has um, and then that's not including when I do all of our bedding and sheets and everything. So that's even more loads when I have to wash our bedding and sheets. So that's just, like I said, typically we have five loads every week. And then um, there are, like every other week, I wash all of our bedding. So that's how I do our laundry. And I'm not really set up on any type of routine. I really just go with it and I just figure out what I can get done in one day. Like I said, I like to try to get it all done at least two days, but sometimes it does take me three, four, five days to get everything knocked out, and that's okay. But if you have a certain type of laundry routine, then I would love to hear down below what your laundry routine is. Just let me know down below in the comments. Um, and like I said, I would love to know how many loads you do a week and also how many people are in your family just to kind of like figure out maybe if I can do something differently. So I love hearing what everyone else does and I'm always up to switching up anything that I'm doing just to make it easier for myself. 
So right now I'm going to go ahead and fold all these towels and put them away. So if you have some laundry that you need to accomplish today, go ahead and grab that load and let's get to washing, drying, and folding together. Like I always say, there's no better way to tackle some laundry than tackling it with a friend and I really hope I can be that friend for you today. Something's off The way you look and how you pause When you talk I think you said enough You said you love for me Something brand new You said this is something You would never do Here we are in your car Let me see who you are Who you really are So now I'm on day two of laundry motivation and the only load I was able to accomplish on day two is mine and Nick's clothes. So I'm done washing them, I'm transferring them into the dryer now to get them all dried. Once they are done drying, I'll take everything out of the dryer and head into mine and Nick's room and go ahead and hang up all of our shirts that needs to be hung up in the closet and then fold everything else and put everything else away. Once I'm done with that, that's all I was able to accomplish on day two, like I said. So day three, I will start off with a load of Ryder's clothes. I'll go ahead and throw his clothes in the washer and get them all washed and clean. When the lights are out and you're stumbling the dark You kept pushing on, but then you went too far Sailed and all your dreams are lost Everything is wrong You feel like it's your fault Just remember
So now that Ryder's clothes are done washing, I'm going to throw everything in the dryer and get everything dried and then head into my next room and go ahead and hang up all of Jacob and Jeremiah's shirts and fold all of their clothes so that way I can put everything away. And then I will take Ryder's clothes out of the dryer once they are done drying and that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed hanging out with me and I hope I was able to give you some motivation to get up and get some laundry done. If you didn't have any laundry to accomplish today, then I hope I was able to give you some motivation to get up and get something on your to-do list checked off. If I was, please let me know by liking this video. It really does help my channel out. Also, don't forget to leave a comment down below. I love chatting, getting to know each and every one of you. Definitely come back for some more laundry motivation and cleaning motivation. And as always, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to hang out with me. It truly does mean the world and I'll catch you in the next one, friends. Bye. I used to stay up all night trying to find my place Chasing me on lights and looking for some kind of trace To leave me out of darkness, give me a little faith Something to make me stronger, someone who could light the way Then you came to me and you gave me reason uh -uh 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 -uh. I almost can't believe it Every time we touch our feet I tried